is still a sleeping and I just got done filming the big grocery haul finished filming the pantry refrigerators and big freezer tour now I'm going to show you guys a household haul if you're new here I like to divide the amount of money that we spend on what I call household items such as toilet paper laundry soap diapers those kind of things that is one part of our budget and then our groceries which is actually like our food is another part of our budget I like to divide it up so I know what I spend on each it's just a habit I've developed over the years ever since I've been thoroughly enjoying this Walmart grocery ordering online and then picking it up or sending my husband to pick it up it all gets paid for in one amount because I've been able to find most of my household items that I can order online and Travis can pick them up with the groceries of some of my other videos I ordered I ordered from Walmart online and then they delivered the household items to my door that's a great way to do it too. It's just if my husband's going to pick up groceries and he can take the seats out of our van, he might as well pick this stuff up as well. Fine for me. I don't have to load any of it or unload any of it. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful thing in my life, which is why I'm getting putting that extra energy into my freezer cooking lately. So I'm going to show you this big household haul. And uh, so with the household haul, I pretty much just think of everything that we need within the house. You know, I ask the kids, hey, do you all need, you know, deodorant or toothpaste or, you know, who do we need more shampoo? Some months, we don't always need the same thing every month. We always need wipes and diapers. Um, also, I am asked, sometimes lovely viewers suggest, you know, why don't I cloth diaper or coupon for diapers or do those extra things? You know, I buy the cheapest diapers that I can find. Usually it's store brand. And actually the diaper, the large diaper boxes I bought from Walmart were marked down. And the diapers broke down to be about 13 cents a diaper, which is a fantastic deal. But I didn't have to put any extra work into that. That was just, I looked for the cheapest price for what was available. Now you can coupon for diapers and you can cloth diaper. Both are wonderful things. Both take an extra amount of time. And if you do watch my videos over here, you know that my extra amount of time looks like about like this. And I just don't have it. We put time into things that are important to us and where we need to put it. I also run a full-time business online. YouTube is part of that, just part of it. And uh, But I have uh, another kind of popular blog called Free Homeschool Deals I've had for about six or seven years. And uh, I have a lot of other hopping around going on. So I put that, I put my extra time, we can use the term loosely, into running my business. And in turn, that buys the diapers. It buys the 13 cent a diaper diapers. And I don't have to cloth diaper or put time into couponing. However, I had several years, uh, Mr. Liam over there and Gabriel, I cloth diapered with both of them. It was just the old fashioned pre-folds and the, and the safety pins and the plastic pants because that was the cheapest form of cloth diapering I found. It worked wonderful. And I did it both with them pretty much from newborn up until they were about two years old. And uh, so I guess that was a total of almost three Love years you, that I cloth diapered. Love you, sweetie. But then once my business side of things started picking up, just buying diapers as a gift to myself. Got all that. But I get that question sometimes, so I just thought I'd answer it here. Anyway, okay, so what we have here is we needed a box of pull-ups. These are just for overnight. Um, it is for Miss Amelia. She's four, and then she just needs to wear pull-ups sometimes at night. You know it happens, right? It happens to the best of us. Big pack of baby wipes. Uh, Mr. Benjamin, cute Benjamin here. He is gaining so much weight now and getting so big. He... I'm starting to buy size two diapers for him now. And then Daniel, of course, is still in size six. I get questions about potty training too. They usually start right around age three. So Daniel will be three in December and that's when we're gonna start. I'm not gonna start before then because I just don't. I like, I like my little loosey-goosey system as most things that I do. So he's still gonna be in diapers. We're not potty training until he's three. Got a big pack of 500 count napkins. I got four bottles of Suave strawberry shampoo and four bottles of conditioner. We use this as bubble bath too, so that's why there's one more of these. Another thing of dandruff shampoo for um, someone who needs that. Another thing of ant bait, because we live in the wilderness and ants think my house is their home sometimes. Um, big thing of sandwich bags. This is for our freezer cooking tomorrow. Two big things of freezer bags. Just another thing of Ziploc storage bags. Um, big thing of saran wrap, big thing of foil. 
two things of kids toothpaste hairspray and yes my hair color yet again it is that time someone asked me in a comment earlier also why I don't buy things like toothbrushes and toothpaste in bulk doesn't mean I haven't ever bought it in bulk but here's a big thing with me I'm not a real big rule follower and I'm not super legalistic <laughs> in a lot of things like it doesn't uh, when, when I say legalistic I mean it's not a rule that I have to follow sometimes I have bought toothpaste in bulk and sometimes I just order one or two tubes if I need it. Uh, also, two big things of Angel Soft toilet paper. And then coming around here, I got another thing of Tide Pods. A couple of you have asked me how I like them. I like them just fine. You know, we also, it's a, this is another thing of how, uh, how things change. I don't stay the same, and I don't always do things the same. So sometimes I'll be on a kick. I make homemade laundry detergent by the 10 gallon bucket and we'll use that for months or years at a time. And then sometimes I just buy something like Tide Pods and uh, do something different for a season. Maybe that's it. I just change it up a little bit sometimes. Uh, and then two things of dishwashing detergent and then my big, uh, whenever I want to use them, big thing of plates to dispose of quickly when we need it. So there you go guys, my real quick haul. All of this, this whole big haul, came right in around $200. If you go over to largefamilytable.com, I have the full price breakdown of what everything cost. I know sometimes I say I will have that done and it's not done, but it will be done this time because I have someone who's gonna do it for me. So I'm doing the video and they're gonna organize my haul for me real quick and I appreciate that. So I'll see you next time with another new video. I know I'm getting a lot of videos out lately, which is fun and uh, God's just given me the grace to really push out videos, like pushing out babies <laughs> during this season. I'll see you next time, bye-bye.